The A51 with the 4100 hardener for water-based products, you can't go wrong. So if you guys, this is probably gonna be the quickest video you'll ever get from me on the page. I just wanted to show you guys a product. So I'm here at the shop, it's Sunday. I'm here at the shop, I'm leaving on Wednesday to go up to PA, so I gotta paint some stuff. But I want to uh, show you guys a couple products that I stumbled across after thousands of hours of spraying over the last like four to five years. Stumbled across this product and it is phenomenal. It's not really a new one, we've been using it, but this model of Renner, the Aquarius A51, is a game changer. It coats super well. The 1K, which is basically no catalyst, sets very well. Now the 2K is what I'm 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 real surprised about. I'm real shocked about. It's this YT4100 hardener for water-based products. It smells like a lacquer. So if I was to be a little, you know, read in between the lines, I feel like the chemical uh, composition behind this product is what is in lacquer paints. And basically they're adding this additive into water-based products to give it that extra hardness. I just finished sanding everything. I just sanded some doors right here and some shelves. I can't even get down to the, the wood, right? I have one coat of primer and then this top coat. It is so durable. Let me see if I can show you guys out here what we got. So we got like four cabinets. The other side is wrapped off so we don't get overspray in there. I mean, as you can see, like I sanded all of this and I'm I, I'm not even at the bare wood, all right? It is so durable. I, I try to like scuff it on my nail. I couldn't do it. Guys, go check it out. You know, if you're spraying cabinets, if you're spraying built-ins, you want to use a water-based product, you don't want to use lacquers. Sorry for the movement. The A51 with the 4100 uh, hardener for water-based products, you can't go wrong. The way that I mix it, so for every ounce that you have in your paint, right? So if you're using 96 ounces of paint, you would want to use 9.6 ounces of hardener. So it's a 10% mixture. So 100 ounces of paint uh, or 100 ounces of paint, yep. You'll want to use 10 ounces of hardener. The way it works is simply like this. So we have our 10 ounces of hardener. We mix it directly into the paint. Try to scoop all of this out of here. And I'm telling you, if you could smell it, it smells just like lacquer. The reason why I know that is because I just did an install for a project and we use lacquer for their paint, their top coat. So we just mix it a little bit. Probably shouldn't have had that stick in there. The way I like to mix it, I put a, a stir, stir wand or a stir stick on a drill and I just mix it at a low setting. So let me go grab that for you guys. So basically I use a drill with the stir, stir stick. And I mix it up for one minute. So I'm not gonna bore you guys with that whole process. I just wanted to quickly get on here and tell you guys about a product. It's the end of the year. It's a Christmas gift to you guys for me, right? I'll show you guys, I guess at the end of this video, the final product install, like the cabinet doors, the cabinet faces, so you guys can get a look at how well this stuff sets. It's a nail from Woodward Work. Peace.